in the viral video going i want to say i'm very deeply sorry i'm ashamed of myself but i've made peace with god if you think those video you have to drop all drop all of them if you think those video will make me stop speaking the truth it's a lie i will never stop speaking the truth because that is the my hands have seen my ears have heard but my mouth can't testify what my eyes just see hello everyone welcome back to plan tv talk show in today's video i want you guys to come along with me to watch this video that will be going viral this is the senior pastor, the GO of Panier of God International Ministry, Dr. Kasi Chuku, a popular pastor who have been seen in a most viral video recently as certain other men of God, calling them fake. It happened that he's the only real man of God, but in another way. Watching these particular videos, I can say, like I said before, my eyes have seen, but my ears have heard a lot of things. But what I see today, my mouth can't say it all. That's why you must watch this particular video with me. That shall not judge, so that you will not be judged. But this particular video, we will judge it. We want everybody to judge us as well. The game that shall rise. of God disgracing those that are hiding under his canopy to do all sort of things. The worst of it all that this man will still go to this altar to brainwash his members that it was a devil that this woman was a set up and the members will still believe it. Kissing passionately and that's how devil tempts people. How wish this was the only thing he did I couldn't I would have just said okay no problem. This man of God a moment after I don't know if it is the same day, but there's also a video of him drinking a bottle of she eniki. You know what is eniki? Not the small size, the big size eniki. Me, sir. Ask a question now, you have declined it now. Your Facebook family and you, they know you. You know How the video got to the public, I don't know. If it's looking for a publicity stunt, I don't know. But is this right for the pastor to do? Pastor Dr. Kase Shuku is an Igbo pastor. This is also him drinking a bottle of Henneke, cheat Henneke. The Henneke was so cold that even the smoke coming out of it, that the person has to carry phone and record it. Who recorded? Maybe church member. The church member must have fed up seeing this pastor atrocity. Living a holy life outside pulpit. That's why he have to gather or summon courage to record him and upload it. It's becoming too much. Oh, he's a man of God. Don't judge. Don't judge. That is how this thing gets to this point. Oh, if it is a Muslim, Muslim don't do this. Muslim don't criticize man of God. That is how we get to this point. These are not men of God. These are not pastors. Anyway, we also come across a video of him apologizing after this particular video went viral. Of him smushing, kissing, passionately with his side chick. Not with his wife. If it was his wife, nobody would talk because... Anyhow, he did it, but though people will still say because he recorded it. How did this video went viral is what we don't know. I doubt it was through his phone, but whatever it is, he knew there was camera in front of him. So maybe intentionally did it to get more publicity. That's what is happening these days. So without wasting much of your time, now let's see how he's going to apologize to the public about the viral videos. And here comes in the viral video going. I want to say I'm very deeply sorry. 
I'm ashamed of myself, but I've made peace with God. I think this whole plan was to silence me. I want to repeat this. If you think those video out there will stop me from speaking the truth, you have just made the biggest mistake of your life. Bobby, drop my new phone number. If you think those video, you have to drop all, drop all of them. If you think those video will make me stop speaking the truth, it's a lie. I will never stop speaking the truth because that is the end. That was the whole plan. I don't want to sell anything. I don't want to come here to make myself look like a saint. Yes, I am guilty. Everything you saw there, I'm guilty. I am sorry. I pleaded. Some of you who are insulting me, some of you who are, who are saying, hey, this and this, that and that, you do worse things than me. Yes, some of you drink too. But please, I want to say, I want to apologize for that viral video at the end. From the depth of my heart, I am really, really ashamed of myself. I'm ashamed of myself. I'm disappointed of myself. I fall so cheap. I, if you tell me I will fall so cheap to myself, I won't believe that. I want to apologize to everybody. I want to apologize to people who are looking up to me. I want to apologize to people who believe in me. I want to apologize to people who never believed that was me. I want to apologize to everybody. I want to say, I am really, really, really sorry. Forgive me from the depth of your heart as I have asked God also for forgiveness. And I took time to apologize to my member also. And I want to ask, I am sorry. I'm sorry, deeply, deeply sorry. Every one of you, I want to say I'm sorry. I am sorry for that video, that viral video showing where I was drinking, uh, Eric uh, with some ladies and all that i want to say i am deeply sorry i hope you guys Forgive are listening me. to his excuse eh? all facebook users all my fans everywhere i want to say forgive me forgive me why i'm apologizing for those video now it was in recovering my phone because after this whole thing this lady made away with my phone it's a friend but she made away with my phone, but I never knew that she was paid to do all this. Now, on the process, why she asked me to pay two million naira, or else she will upload those videos, and also for me to go and need an, and apologize. And I said, I will not do that. I will not pay two million naira. I am ready to see those videos on Facebook and come out and apologize to everybody. Now, I want to say this. Please, forgive me. Forgive me. I'm ashamed of those videos. Forgive me. I'm here to apologize to everybody. Forgive me. Now, so many contradictions about my arrest because the police are still in this issue. So uh, there are there are restrictions of ways I have to be restricted from. I hope you understand. I don't want to intercept the investigation of the Nigeria police. Please. Now, after she tried to make me pay two million, I refused. She called me to come and pick up my phone. Now, my house to that hotel is the same fence. Is the same fence so i drove out that very early in the morning to meet her to get my phone dear was but please but that's not the reason why i came out with time we are going to unveil this whole thing happening i want you to be to look at this spiritually if you are intelligent if you are sensitive i want you to know that something is actually playing somewhere but please i will beg all my followers Okay, my new number is 0916466 It's for now, put all the blame on me. I am sorry. I know they have a lot of video, the one I was kissing and all that, drinking. A lot, a lot. Please, they are free to post it there and I, I'll be happy for the law to take place because I sense blackmail. It is blackmail. They want to silence me. They want to stop me from saying the truth. 
they came through that way and you see like i said I, if i narrate this story to you you are going to be shocked but i feel i should first of all accept that i'm guilty i'm guilty i'm sorry everybody i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry but no man can stop me from the truth my name is apostle dr Cassidy. they call me the lion killer you can't stop me from the truth they have done their worst let them do more it's okay i am not here to blame anybody but to blame myself who falls short of my integrity thank you everybody i love you all from the depth of my heart bye bye sorry i can't respond to your message so many of you will insult me it's okay it's okay i know you are perfect go ahead okay i've said time with that number on this my channel but i am not perfect thank you very much the reason why i would beg that you don't push me to say more is allow the nigeria police to please complete their investigation the investigation is going on how two of my phone was was uh, collected from me you understand and how some content was being posted out and all that please just be here we'll get to the truth of this whole issue please i beg you all in the name of god please forgive from the depth of your heart i beg all my members those in nigeria doing diaspora thank you very much i want to thank them from the warm welcome they gave to me today thank you very much it was amazing it was mind-blowing they, they have been encouraging me all those of you who have been calling encouraging me thank you 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 for encouraging me thank you everybody thank you what you did is I, I appreciate them those of you who believe in me thank you those of you who see trust in me thank you those of you who don't trust in me thank you thank you everybody for now i'm out of here my name remains apostle dr kasi chuku they call me the lion killer the pretty encyclopedia the pretty catalyst love you guys join me on my tomorrow service bye 11 a.m i'll be preaching live god bless you who god has blessed no man let no man curse if god has forgiven me please do forgive me thank you very much i accept my mistake if every pastor would take this same step anytime they go wrong and apologize nigeria will be a better place and the church will be a better place i'm happy that i set the space thank you everybody goodbye my opinion about it is that don't use these men of God or people calling themselves men of God to discredit other good ones. In every association, there are always weevil amongst the good ones. There are always black sheep amongst the white ones. There are always wolf amongst the sheep. That is how it is. People know that water kills, water saves. Whatever it is, you soon drink water. There are good or fake money, but you still use money. There are good food, there are bad food, but yet we eat. So don't say because what these men of God are doing that you will not serve God anymore. You will not go to church. Changing church does not mean you change God. It's just you live in that place that is not preaching the sermon you want to hear about God. People don't care anyway. But if you care, don't blame it on him. Change church. Go to the next church. Keep on going till you find a better place to worship God. That is it. Don't say you worship God in your own house. All right, guys. This is where we end the video today. Until we meet again, stay with me with my BTV team. And for all our returning subscribers, may God continue to bless you for supporting the growth of this channel. For always returning to watch, share, and like. If it is the first time of coming across our videos, please do and devote to subscribe, like, and share, or comment your thoughts regardless to any of our videos. There are a lot of amazing videos already waiting for you on our platform. This is Plan TV, and I say big thank you. Until we meet again. Peace out. I love you guys. Don't forget to subscribe to get notified. And I see the show your support. Now say God go bless you too. Dance on the bed. Blambi TV, Blambi TV, Blambi TV.